What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of FPS dropping, frame dropping or soldering issue you're currently having with Satisfactory. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial. In the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know, let you guys know that, that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to open up your task manager by simply navigating down to your taskbar, right clicking it and opening up your task manager. What I want you to do next is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes just to ensure that you're sticking around it. And afterwards, I want you to click onto CPU and end every single task which has obviously nothing to do with Windows by just simply right clicking it and clicking onto end task. And do the same thing for a GPU. So let me explain that. Too many applications, background processes, programs running at the same time with too much CPU or GPU usage on a low end or bad PC will cause your game to, cra uh, to crash yeah, or to have FPS drops freezing or stuttering. So just by, uh, you could avoid this issue by just doing that. So once you're finished, you should be able to end this task. And the next step is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, clicking onto Windows symbol, opening up your settings, navigating right into gaming, and stick around the Xbox Game Bar, we obviously want you to turn this off. Because the Xbox Game Bar doesn't really come with, with any benefit besides impacting your performance really bad, causing stuttering, so just simply turn this off. Next up is going to be to click onto Captures. And I want you to go to Background Recording and navigate to Recording the Background while I'm playing a game. Obviously turn this off. Because especially if this is turned on without you knowing that, this will impact your your performance on your PC really bad. And you either way, guess just you don't want to record with Windows, so just Come back once in a while just to check if this is really turned off. Next step is going to be to click onto game mode. And I can't really tell you now to turn this off or on. You just need to check it for your system specifically and just stick with the setting which is working better. Once you're finished, go back once and click onto update and security. We want you to just stick around Windows Update. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on PC will help you with like every kind of issue you're currently having and also with stutterings. So just trust me and do that and start up with a Windows Update by just clicking on to check for updates. Once you're finished, just simply end this task and do the same thing for a graphics card. So just download the latest driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video. I hope that it could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one, and bye.